rhythm going up the line. Welcome to Rip City. Lakers wearing their home gold uniforms. Pow. Mid-range. Cash. Count it. Damian Lillard. Six pick in the draft. Batum. Kick it. Baseline. Hickson. Not going to get there. Nash battling, and Kobe will come up. He's a slasher, plus a good three-point shooter misses. Under the world piece, MWP puts it up and in. Wow. Hickson, horrible pass because Hickson was there. Nash finds Dwight Dominate. He goes, put it up and in. Hopefully those two, uh, D-Ware, but of course, uh, Dwight Howard, the last line of defense on the possible pick and roll. Here's Kobe attacking the basket and scoring. Nine rebounds. He can and should be a better rebounder, though. Powell, he's got two mid-range shots. Not start for Powell after that brilliant statistical line last night, 23, 13, and 6. Underneath, forget about that. It's out of bounds. Young Damian Lillard was getting ready to flush one. And gets it rejected. Well, Damian Lillard did not play against White earlier. Great pass down the middle goes Kobe. Look out. Fortunate that he didn't get hurt. But that last basket is Dwight just waits and hands it off. And Kobe with the nice finish. Nobody home down to make a bit of difference is Dwight Howard and his teammates trying to get win number one. Stay consistent. Our Carl's cam shows that basket I was talking about with Dwight Howard. Little cut by Kobe, handoff, and that's the way you finish around the rim. Basket. Yeah, second leading power forward score in the NBA behind Kevin Love. Quick trigger for Devin Ebanks. One. Lakers were middle of the pack last year, scoring and opposing scoring in the NBA, 15th. Aldridge again over to Saul. Oh, that's a tough call against Jordan Hill. Well, head to the timeout. Two ball moving, anticipating where the ball is going to be missed, being in position to secure. Look at the shot clock. Now they have to go to work. Now has to go to work. There he is. He's going to the basket with the left hand. Hart's going to get the bounce and score. Paul Gasol. But the Lakers down by four. Architect on that Dallas championship winning team. Willard again. Oh, great play by Steve Blake. Tying him up. Fender. He had his eye on Jordan Hill. And in the process, <laughs> Steve Blake said, let me see if I can get my hands on this ball down low. And did that and created but that's a turnover for the Blake. Creates an opportunity for Dwight Howard to the basket. He goes and he's fouled by Boy, he catches quick, it, faces move, up, huh? and says, Here I go. <laughs> Talk about here I go. <laughs> right around the defender. No Career spacing. average of 19. There's no spacing there. That's why it was so difficult to get it into him. Again, a spin on Howard. They double up and they foul him again. By show me you've got the jump shot. He, he's still trying to play belly to belly, and Dwight's going right around him. Gets into the painted area, gets the play. Remember, he was really efficient from the floor yesterday. Good entry under to Dwight, he scores. Gets it and faces up. Timeout, 8.36, as Kobe says, Dwight, do what you do. Dwight says, don't worry about a thing. He and Wesley Matthews continues. Matthews now getting aggressive. Good pass on me. Stripped away by the Lakers, and they take control. Before to keep sending Dwight to the free throw line, all the bigs they have, they have each one with six to give. Kobe rises and knocks it down. Just put it home there, but Kyle misses the jumper, and Howard's got the rebound. Wide open three. MWP for three. From the within one with his long three. And after that, it's turnover time again as the Blazers take an advantage. The NBA's most efficient offense, seven straight years when he was with Phoenix outside, another three. Dwight Howard, you got nine on the shot clock. Dark pass to Kobe down the lane, scores. But a minute ago, he did a good job of, of finding a cutting Kobe Bryant. Keep your head up. Nice move by Kobe. And just stand around. Nice dive to the basket. Gets their pass and stop. He was wide open. Nobody close. Now, got it. Now bounces to Aldridge. Oh, it's going to go out of bounds. The latest to knock down the jumper. Well, shake and bake for Howard underneath. High off the glass as they doubled him up and he missed. Yeah, that secondary defender really caused uh, Dwight little problems on that occasion. Lakers down by five. Well, that one was hot. I'd make him come out and just, to, just to see. So not good news for the Lakers. By Kobe, towards right there. Ooh. Yeah, that's those are the ones that hurt. You can see it's just a bump of the knees, but it it caved in Steve's left knee. So it wasn't just a matter of bumping knees. He had knee contact. Uh, Lillard again. I mean, he is just 
so smooth. There have been three other Blazer rookies of the year. Kobe Bryant just tonight. Think about that for a second. And that's Nolan Smith. No other starter has an assist. And no peace. WP for no, it's star in the making. Pound us all. Lob underneath to Dwight. This man's debut this year. Delayed a little bit because of his injury. Dwight Howard going to work underneath with the left hand. Put up and in. That's, yeah, that's a nice move. Kept Hickson off balance the whole time. Kobe digging in on defense, knocks it away from behind, but has LaMarcus lose control. Howard doubled up, now spinning baseline again using the left hand, remember? Here's Lillard all the way, put it up around Dwight. Dwight just barely got back in time to a very thin bench. But some talented young guys that start to get up and down the floor and score. Dwight's got it, and Dwight rams it home. But foul and three-point opportunity is uh, on the other possession, the last possession of the Lakers, Dwight had the ball bounce right to him for the easy deuce. Obviously, you hope the Lakers recognize that. Kobe certainly will. He rises for a long three. Dwight. Burns continues against the Blazers. Dwight with a sweeping hook. Antoine will be in when it's dead. Back out to Blake for three in the corner. Yes, sir. A couple of times. Lakers started 0 for 4 from beyond the arc. They're 7 for their last night. Howard goes to the left hand. Blake, don't you think you need to take a shot? Yeah, take it and make it. <laughs> and Dwight, well, you've taken a few. With the left, that is nice. Tail of a couple of halves. Picked up in the second half where he left off in the first. A couple of plays in the first half that he... Got some easy ones, working on the inside, utilizing that left, gets a lot from Powell. Then in the third quarter here, he's right back to work again. With the left, then he showed me the teardrop hook shot. <laughs> I gotta ask him how he developed that one, where you do the teardrop hook. That's my sense being choppy. I, I'm more concerned now about their defense. They just don't seem to be on the same page, and the Blazers taking full Advantage. Manchester City, Wicks, Brandon Roy, and Jeff Petrie were all rookies of the year. He has a shot out 99-81. 18 and 19 free throws for Portland. And Dwight scores, and he'll get another opportunity. World Peace is over there asking, where is the flagrant foul? 31 for D12. And he goes to the line where he's 13 for 16, and Meta is really amped. Bryant finds Powell. He's going to attack the basket. A little floater in the lane for touching that floater early in games. Oh, that was telegraphed. And Meadow will piece that hand on it, but he couldn't control. Leonard. Well, uh, he's going to stop. There's only so much number 55 can take. And that's the referee. Wright's not going to shoot from out there. Those were Powell's first points a moment ago since the first quarter. Colby trying to at least draw a foul, doesn't get a whistle. He's glaring, and he picks it up. Technical foul, Bryant. The other end gets a little bit of a teardrop of his own to fall, but the Lakers down big. And it's all a falling lot, apart. A lot of it with the uh, poor de uh, defense and this tonight. Matthews, now he's directing traffic. You can see how he's interchangeable. That's a foul on World Peace and a hard foul on Batum. He on the Lakers. Coming off to curl, Batum goes up and gets hammered by World Peace. So he'll go to the line and shoot two free throws. He's the, the gift. But still tonight, Blazers are 86% from the line, and maybe for a foul, we will go right back to Brian. He's attacking all the way, put it up and missed. He did get a whistle again. Kobe can't get a whistle the last two games. Here's somebody sprawling on the floor, and that's his fifth. So now Howard has five. There's Dwight trying to throw Hickson out of the way. So count the basket to number 16. <laughs> and also, yeah, if there was a, light, a switch to be flipped, it certainly hasn't happened. Howard. Can't get around Hickson underneath Kobe's work and finally gets a whistle. See, of switching hands and shooting it with his uh, left. Uh, battling on the offensive end, getting that miss by Dwight. And then somehow with defenders all around him, throws it up, throws it in. A career 84% free throw shooter. Okay. Won't come back here till April. 
Knocked down with the defender. <laughs> Blake turns around and hits it. Four second clock. Bounce pass underneath. That's blocked by World Peace on the shot clock. It's going down to six. Blake, they'll be shooting just about half the buzzer. And he makes it. Win, it doesn't matter. Kobe attacking, goes all the way, can't score, gets the rebound. Kobe underneath, puts it up and puts it in. Boy, he battles. Yeah, and he's 30 for Kobe, 33 for Dwight. Boy, and he came up gimpy after that, though. Kobe is not feeling yeah. real good. Dunked home by World Peace. It's convert him into points as uh, Steve Blake slapped it right out of J.J. Hickson's hands. And World Peace with the dunk. But then coming down next... Tonight, the bench collectively, 15 points. So 32 in the 